a little over a month ago, I was showing off a print. And then, since then, this is video seven of making the Delta Vega Props tricorder kit. And I have to say, it's done. Greetings, Dave here, DCBFX. So this has been so great, I'm at the end. I've completed this dry quarter. Let me just take you down through a few steps. As we're down to the last strokes on getting this whole tri quarter working, it's down to the graphic. So these are about 1.8 inches across, and they fit perfectly in the slot. What you need to do is get them hooked up with the light funnel. And what I like to do with this is wrap it in a little bit of aluminum foil because that way it just works so much better by reflecting light. So what you're doing basically is this light here is going on there. Now there's a trick to what I do with this and that's not necessarily the right way to do it. This is the way I do it. So if I put that there, put the graphic on like that. Hang on a sec. Let me just mute this. So we put the graphic on like that. It really just, it, it, it blasts it through. So what I do is I print two of them. That way the black has a better chance to resist out. So we do that. You have to line them up first. It looks so much better for the light. So that's what I'm working on right now. And that's going to be done soon. So let me hop in here for a second. I'd like to just thank all the new subscribers as I get so, 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 so close to the 1,000 I'm looking for. If you could, if you're here and you're not subscribed, if you could click below, that'd be great. Uh, give me a like, give me a subscribe, ring the bell, then you'll hear about when I go live and when I do a short. Apparently I'm doing shorts now. And um, that'd be great. All right, back to the build. So here's the graphic finished. What I'd like to do is take some packing tape and put it over top and then I use that to hold the second piece on and that gives it a nice glossy finish that you would expect from an actual screen. See that? So now I need to install that into here and then glue the whole thing into the body. All right, so now I've got this all glued together and now this here, it looks like that. And that looks pretty darn nice. So. Time to install that into the body, and then I'm just about done with this tricorder. Now the glue is set. It looks like this. All that's left to do is add some little shims on here, and then I'll add the graphic, and then this sucker is done. So here we go, I've added these little pieces of styrene here, glued them in. Just, it raises the button just a little bit. So now it's all I have to do is to add the graphic. So here it is, finished, the Delta Vega Props Science Tricorder. So that is how I built the Delta Vega Props tricorder. That's not to say this is the way to do it, but this is the way after making a couple, this makes sense to me. Hopefully this helps you get through what you want to do in order to do it. Now, a couple things that I did differently, I don't know if you noticed that or not, but right here, these are supposed to be inside and coming out. I want to do it a little bit differently, so I actually put them on the top rather than inside. The way that the print is, it's supposed to go inside and come out, so it's all flush. I wanted that a little bit different. So that's the way I did it, not the way you have to do it. But granted, this is your tricorder. This is what you're going to do with your um, your kit. You're going to build it the way you want to do. Uh, the graphic I have is just a graphic that I found I thought was pretty cool. This is actually one, if you look at my some of the things I've made, 
that are made available for you uh, to download. This graphic is actually in one of the video animations. I just thought it's cool because it's a science tricorder. It's a sciencey thing to do. And this looks great. I think this is fantastic. I'm really happy with how this came together. I'm also very happy, as I said, that the closing ratchet works because that is just so awesome. Here, let me just do this again. It's just, I know all the stuff in the show was done in post. I know it was because that's why you do it. Like the fact that the thing lit up at all was pretty amazing too. But this is such a great prop and I'm just happy to be working with Delta Vega Props in order to bring this out to you people. Now I guess what's probably the question on your mind now is as you're watching this, you've watched all seven videos of how to build this thing. How do I get one? Stay tuned. We're going to bring that out soon. We're going to figure out what the cost and all this is because we're figuring the cost of making the boards and the cost of making the bodies and the cost of shipping and cost of all these things. We're going to get that together for you soon. Hopefully we have to have a, a meeting as a group and talk about that. But we're going to get that done soon. We'll have these available for people to, to buy soon. And then when you get to building it, hey, you've got any questions? Hop online. Send me a, send me a quick chat. Send me a quick uh, DM to the, well, this video if you want. And we'll talk. But that is, to me, this is a great kit. And having built a couple of these, I think I know what I'm talking about. So there you go. I'm very happy to have uh, built this for you. I'm happy to have people watching it. I'm watching my analytics and people are watching this a lot, which is great. So thank you for everyone watching. And uh, hey, everyone have a great day. And we'll talk to you all later.